Opening day for these two teams in the Copa Libertadores and the excitement is building. Stay with us, we'll have all the action live on EA TV. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon. And on the menu, an appetising dish. A Conmebol Libertadores first group stage game. It's Flamengo and they face Fluminense. Well, thank you, Derek. As a team, you can really set the tone of the whole competition in these early rounds. Really put a marker down. Everyone is watching. Set the standards, Derek. And the contest begins. A creative look about this. A fine use of the ball. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Lee, in particular, what do you expect to see from his game? Well, basically, you've got to keep him out of the box because he's got such a brilliant finishing ability that you give him half a yard, he will score. So keep him as far away from your goal as possible. It's opening up for them. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And take it away. Now can they make something happen? It might be on for them. This looks promising. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Fruitful looking attack. Really important piece of last ditch defending. Well, a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. A bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Well, can they make one of these passes count? Can he keep his composure? it well still passing it around with authority
Well, as you can see from the possession, there's little between these two teams. It's been a real tight, cagey affair. You just hope it opens up a little, that one of these teams is willing to take a few risks. And so it is, the first half story. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. And that was a move of great promise. They could easily have been in. It looks promising. And they have possession again. He was one of their better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Lee, your thoughts? Well, no goals for him, no real chances either. He needs to help his team a little bit more just to get involved in the game. I think he would be the difference if he was playing better. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Could cross it in here. Looks promising this. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Oh, they've lost it. Well, not giving him any breathing room. To jump in front. Oh, goodness me, he's hit the post. Well, so close to breaking the deadlock, but not to be. The woodwork came to the rescue, Derek. Now, let's see what they can do here. Can he put them in front? Can they get in behind them? Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Now the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look, can he make it count? And able to get a body in the way. Read it well. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Can they grab the lead late on? Real danger. Can they forge ahead? And the post denied him. And there it is! Surely the goal that will give them Derby bragging rights. No wonder the fans are going crazy. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick out a teammate. There's still a lot of work to be done, but the keeper presents the near post on a plate and he's punished. That's quite remarkable. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And it's a case of just five minutes left.
Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. And that is full-time, really the worst possible start, you've got to say. That's the last thing you need. Start of the qualifying 